Oh. Oh, right. I can use this door like a bridge. Pant, pant. I don't know how, but I made it out in one piece. Oh. Bye, bridge. Eep! Uh, sure hope nobody was down there. Ow! Ugh. This really hurts. Right, arm is broken. Completely dislocated. Feels like it's clinging together by muscles and sinew alone. God, it hurts so much. Then just pop it back into place. That's what you can do if, like, something's dislocated. It really, really fucking hurts. But you just put it back in and you're fine. Have to, ugh, hold it together with my hand. Oh, do I get to control you now? Nope. Pant, pant. Mm -mm. Oh. Let's go. Shinazaki. Kishinuma. Please, be okay. I'm coming to find you. Okay. I'm guessing now we go to Kishinuma and Shinazaki. You say your students aren't listening to you. Oh. I just don't know what to do. I feel like I've lost the will to teach. Hmm. I receive emails from the parents and guardians every single day. They say I'm a teacher who gets no results. That I'm useless. Going over... Oh, going over my head straight to you? That's terrible. I'm the homeroom teacher here. I should be the one answering to them. This is my fault for always going away on business trips and leaving you to fend off the wolves on your own. They must have given you hell. I'm so sorry. No, I'm the assistant homeroom teacher. It's my duty to tend the class in your absence. In fact, it's been my honor to have you entrust me with your students. It's just that, lately, no matter what I say, every last student in class 2-9 makes a joke out of it. And if I react too strongly, they all start to talk back. They must hate me by now. But I don't blame the parents. The bottom line is what's important. It's, a, all, about, it's all about results. I fucked up that sentence, I'm sorry. And what I want... Most of all, is to be able to give these kids passing marks for their own futures, if nothing else. And if they get good grades, then... Oh, Shishido. Y yes I want you to close your eyes. Whoa, this is getting weird. And think back. Huh? Think back to what? <laughs> to your students, of course. Every day, you give 110% for them. And you know as well as I do that some of them truly appreciate it. Any guesses which one? Which ones? Sorry. You really think any of them care? Absolutely. How about Shinazaki, who usually hates her teachers? She's in the staff room asking you questions every day. And Kishinuma, who almost never came to school at all last year, has been here at least four times each week since you started. Never thought I'd see the day. The students have taken notice, and they appreciate you. Believe me, they don't hate you one bit. But, even if that's true, I still don't get results. I mean, they may like me, but if they don't get the grades to back it up, their parents never will. And more importantly, if my students can't get good grades, then I've failed them as a teacher. It's true that things may look different from the parents' point of view than they do from the school's. And a student's ability to excel is indeed of the utmost importance. But the way I see it, the means through which you teach the students is just as important as the material they learn. In fact, it may even be more important. We only get those children for three short years. During that time, one must wonder... Did they enjoy their classes? Will they remember them as valuable, meaningful experiences? 
After all, their worries, resolutions, life lessons, and moments of personal growth. Will they look back at these three years during graduation and say, I really enjoyed the school? Ensuring that they do is just as much as part of the teacher's job as the material she teaches. And it's not just Shinazaki and Kishinuma. Think back, think about Shinohara, whose home life had really been getting her down. And Nakashima. After they met you, their smile seems seemed to get a lot brighter. Nakashima. Who the fuck's Nakashima? I don't remember that name. Shinohara. <laughs> She's got a real knack for hiding her true feelings, doesn't she? What can I do for my students? As soon as you start asking yourself that question without even thinking about it, then you're a bona fide teacher through and through. Bona fide, sorry. In fact, I even say once you reach that point, you've proven that education is in your nature. Basically, that you were born to teach. And no one can take that honor away from you. So how about you reclaim what's rightfully yours, hmm? <laughs> It's remarkable how little you've changed from when you were a student here yourself. <laughs> Whenever you had something on your mind, you'd always seek my guidance. With eyes wide and full of tears. You shouldn't strain yourself so much, Shishido. Enjoy what you do. You get to spend every precious day with a whole host of interesting youths. The youth. What will you... Bah! Wait till you get to your first graduation and have somebody tell you, Thanks for everything, Teach. It's the best feeling in the world. <laughs> Heck. I'll get in contact with the parents and guardians and try to set them straight. And tomorrow, or whenever you'd like, you can go over some lesson plans together to help ensure we get these students to the graduation safe and sound. Okay. Um. Hmm? Thanks for everything, Teach. You bet. You know, that's another great feeling. Being able to pass the torch and rely on one of your old students to keep your affairs in order. <laughs> oh. Now her students are dying. Huh? A dream. I feel like I've been dreaming for a long time. Terrible, ominous dreams, where Nakashima and the others all lost their lives. I wonder where I am. Oh! What? Um. No! Miss Shishido, Miss Shishido! Don't you understand the gravity of the situation? Go! Now! What? Now I remember. I got buried in rubble after that. Shinazaki, I hope you were able to get out safely. What can I do for my students? As soon as you start asking yourself that question without even thinking about it, then you're a bona fide teacher, through and through. I guess... I did finally become a little more like the teacher I wanted to be. But it hasn't even been a year. I can't move my body. Can't even feel my lower half. Everything's below my neck, paralyzed. It's so dark, so lonely. I wanted to live just a little longer. Oh, and oh, no, we're good. Am I crying? <laughs> I'm almost dead, and here I am crying. Oh, I can't do anything. Sob. I don't like most of my teachers very much. But I love Miss Shishido. She feels almost like a big sister to me. Hey, 
Miss Yui, is it true you have a cat? I was thinking of adopting this little guy, but I'm not sure how to go about it. Here, have a look. <laughs> He's adorable! Look at his fat little body, and where are his ears? I wasn't asking you. Hey, Miss Yui, about that floppy droopy panda necklace you've got? Are you wearing it right now? It's hard to tell with those honking tracks of... Haha. <laughs> Ow! Miss Yui, your bike chain came off today, no? Never seen you take a spill like that before. You look so forlorn. It was kind of cute. <laughs> Do guys make these comments to teachers? <laughs> I wish you all the very best. Like, seriously, what? What? Please, don't die. Forge a path of yourselves. Oh, for yourselves, sorry. Don't let your future slip away. Well, this is sad. Bye, teach. What if, that, like, that was just the end of the chapter? Just right there. Just ended. I'm so cold. Mom? Dad? Yes? Monet. I feel so alone. I'm scared. Oh, and then she goes into the light. Fun. Wrong end? Wait, what? Y you can't be serious. What? Wait, what? That was actually the whole chapter? No, I was just joking. No way was that the whole chapter. No way. No way. Just like 50 minutes. That was the whole chapter? Y you gotta be shitting me. I didn't even do anything. I just walked around. No way. <laughs> no way. That was, that was the whole chapter. Just 50, I've been recording for 50 minutes. And that was the whole thing? No. I, I can't accept that. No way. No way. You've got, I must have missed something. I had to have missed a whole bunch of shit. There's no way. There's no way that that was just 50 minutes. There's no way. I I had to have missed something. I had to have missed something. There's there's no way that that was only 50 minutes. There's no way. I had there must have been more. I must have like if Shinazaki didn't die like I must have skipped a whole bunch of shit. Because how the fuck was... That... No, that couldn't have been the whole chapter. That could not have been the whole chapter. No. No way. No way. If the achievement pops up... Chap extra chapter 3. She knows the key is now available for play. Okay. But that was... No, that wasn't the whole chapter. Wait, what? I'm... Hold up. I gotta check something. Okay. I knew that, that, that there was no way that that was that much. Okay. I knew. So that's one of the endings. Okay. Uh. Let's just continue from the very first save. Because you can actually save Naomi. You can save Naomi. But I just can't let you 